days, which Rooney came out on top, beat Rudisha. So he wants revenge. He has only waited 10 years. He's got Mark English, Jack Green, Sebastian Roger, Jacob Paul, and Elliot Giles to contend with as well. So will the legendary double Olympic champion at 800 metres, David Rudisha, have enough speed over this 500 metre distance? Martin Rooney in his past has run some 800s way back when. Croydon Harrier. So it's not as though this uh, might be a little too far for him. And I think he might just do exactly what he's doing here. Just take it to Rudisha, run it like a 400 metre man, grab it by the scruff of the neck and away he goes. Rudisha latched onto him straight away. Bit of a downhill start there. So the big two big names here, really. One and two. And behind them, others uh, looking to get into this. Mark English, who's run very well in this and has run sub-60, which would be a great performance. He's in third place. Seb Roger is uh, there. Jack Green is there. But it's Rudisha now starting to push on. Jack Green trying to get closer if he can. Rooney up onto the ramp, up onto the track. But it's Rudisha coming away here. The 800 metre man showing his class, showing his strength, showing his ability. And indeed, the other 800 metre specialist, Mark English, starting to come through now. The stamina tells. The endurance boys have it. David Rudisha wins. And that's a very fast time. 57.7. Well either on a track or on the road in the track as this one is that i think is the fastest we've ever seen in the world so congratulations to david rudisha really did attack it hard after about 300 meters a good finish from mark english judged his effort well and the 400 lads have to hang their head in shame and bow down to the great david rudisha that was a little bit as it was in the in the women's 500 meters. It was the 800 meter runners dominating, and you'd think 500. Well, it's closer to 400 in terms of distance than 800, but it's not really. So you've got that extra strength, and 800 meter runners can always step up in pace, but 400 meters perhaps don't have that endurance that the 800 meter runners have. So in, in the end, as you said, with Mark English giving David Rudisha the closest run, very good run from the Irishman, but Rudisha controlling that. And really did what he ran it pretty well. He did what he had to do in the early stages, but they just don't have that same endurance that the are effectively middle distance runners have. And let's not forget David Rudisha, pretty good at 400 metres as well. His dad won an Olympic medal in the 4x4 relay all the way back in, I can't remember, 68 or 72, I can't remember now, 68 I think it was in Mexico. Anyway, David Rudisha, big smile on his face, great performance from him, and um, congratulations all round. We'll catch up with David Radisha shortly. I wonder if he'll ever have a go at the Great North Run in years to come.